Hello there, I'm Aldra Hill, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, collab with my dry bread. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it every single time we do an intro, I say, like, oh, you speak, and then there's like three seconds of silence, and then you laugh. There's like a snicker. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're the best co-host <laughs> ever. Oh, shit's hitting the fan. It's so really hitting the fan. Really badly. <laughs> So we're we're I'm defending the Syrian border with basically everything I've got. About a third of my troops. They've pushed a little bit, but I've got them control. I'm controlling a river, so I'm fine. Oh shit! No, hang on. I need to stop these guys from moving. Um, MDB is for defending like what is this area? Like a little peninsula in Greece against like 30 Italian yeah. divisions. Oh my god! I'm defending against all up against. Hang on, wait, let me count. 40 of it. There are 40 divisions attacking from one island. If I hadn't taken Crete, I'd probably be screwed right now. Holy crap. Okay. How many divisions well, are, you, are you recruiting? Uh, uh, like how many are being made at a time? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nice. I'm only building. A lot of them are about to finish. I'm building seven. Oh, I'm still. I'm giving you. I'm giving you 10% of my infantry equipment, aren't I? Yeah, I don't think you need to do that anymore because I'm at a big profit now. Uh, what's your how, how much you got stored? Uh, ten thousand. Oh, for fuck's sake! Why didn't you tell me? I've been doing this. I did. I I I completely forgot you had a land lease going. How the hell do I cancel this? Oh my god! I need to turn this off. Cancel land lease. There we. Yeah, fifteen percent. Oh my god, that's gonna help. I mean, I, I can start recruiting yep. more infantry units now. Okay, let's unpause. Let's do. That's oh. a plus sixty a turn. Well, there was a while when you started that land lease. I was about to go in the negatives. I had two hundred. Yeah. That land lease really helped me. Oh yeah, I'm getting positive fifty even after the land lease is nice. done. I'm good. You ready? Um. Yeah, I'm good let's to go. Let's do it, man. Let's do it. I'm ready. I can do this, maybe, possibly. In fact, I just moved a few military factories to going back to towed artillery because I actually have a little bit of a deficit on that. Whereas awesome. infantry equipment, I'm good. I'll be fine. Oh, oh my god, so many things happened. Okay, so Germany just did the oh, Anschluss. Okay. Yeah, they did the Anschluss. Poland has done the Poland first. We expected Good. that. We expected that, so that's alright. Yeah. Um, Jesus Christ. What else? I mean, I, got, I think I'm going to go Doctrine effort so I can get better Doctrines. Yeah, Germany is a little bigger now. So Germany's now going to start hating you pretty bad. Because they touch you. Yeah. Yeah. If, but however, they're sending volunteers to us, so... Let's just hope they don't try I... to... Uh, God, I'm really reject. I'm really regretting rejecting the anti turn pact right about now. Yeah, or else but, they'd, they'd really love me if I accepted yeah. that. Yeah, but think about it, though. If Germany does declare war on you and they and they and, and Hungary doesn't join, you can defend over a river in mountains and forests. They'll never get through. Yeah. Of course, if they take Czechoslovakia Still. and Hungary, then it's not. It's an entirely different question. I like my choke point. I know. I know. All right. All right. I'm worried about Syria because there's a lot of death happening. How many, yeah. how many people have died? You know, not that many. Oh, I've lost 95,000 in the Greek-Romanian War, by the way. Jesus, I didn't lose nearly that many. I'm actually pushing on them a little bit. Or attempting to. Wow, you lost more than Romania in that war. Well, to yeah. be fair, it, it's counting after Romania capitulated and you went to war with France. So. Yeah, France is doing shit to me, man. It's harsh. Now, in the Italian war, we are wrecking them. Oh, it's horrible, isn't it? <laughs> like, it's a slaughter. 16 versus 90. Jeez, 17 yeah. versus 90. They're probably going to start... They're probably suffering attrition as well on that crappy island. Yeah, they are. Oh, my God. Yeah. All the armies there are suffering 22% attrition. Okay, so... Uh, do I want dispersed support or integrated support Ooh, in my strategy. superior firepower doctrine? Yeah, because I've got uh, I've got the doctrine like yeah. discount thing. So basically, dispersed support increases the actual. If you have artillery as like you're in your division, as in like you know seven two seven infantry two artillery, then that yeah that's that, what I do. Then that's dispersed is better because it gives the first one's kind of crap. It just increases their recovery rate because their recovery is really bad. Yeah. But the second yeah. one is 10% soft attack, and when, the, when they give you about 200, that's an extra 20, which is great. Integrate, that's enormous. Integrate support is really, really good if you either don't do that, or if you also use a large amount of tanks and motorized and cavalry divisions, because that increases soft attack and organization for general, anytime anyone uses support artillery, any division support artillery. And then the okay. combat teams is pretty good too. But it's better, I think, to go line artillery, if you have line artillery, to go that. 
Yeah, I think I'll go Dispersed because right now I don't even have tanks researched. By yeah. the time I'd get any serious advantage in Integrated, we wouldn't, that yeah. wouldn't be a big Wait, deal anymore. Do you have 7-2? Uh, yes, I you believe piece so. Of shit. I, I don't, I don't, I haven't, I haven't made any yeah, artillery. I got seven, I got seven, two, but no support. I haven't had the chance to make any artillery, honestly. Because I'm just making oh, got, so I, many I'm divisions. I'm pumping out artillery like mad because... Uh, you like, got any I, spare? I'm always, I'm always running a deficit, unfortunately, and I, I, I am in negative almost 600. Uh, but, uh... How many am I making right now? Uh, six point three net profit right now. Jesus. Um, I have I have almost two rows of factories on it right now, and only one row in infantry because infantry I'm always in profit. Yeah. Shit, I should have been a. Uh, I should have been sending you less infantry equipment. I should be making artillery. Damn it. I'm making as many light tanks as I can, but it's just it's hard, you know. Ooh, I should actually put recon companies in my infantry divisions because yeah, I'll yeah. come out with still 800 in storage. I'm doing nice. it now. There right, we go. I'm, I'm about to go back to unpausing. Oh my god. All right, go for it. Okay, I think this is going relatively okay. The Syrian border is pushing kind of heavily. Oh, I just heard another naval invasion noise. Um, shit. Not me, though, so it's fine. Oh my god, if they take Rhodes, uh... I'm so fucked. They're taking another island, I think. If it's Rhodes, another one of the I Greek am, islands. If it's Rhodes, I am fucked. Like fully. no, they're they're going after uh, the one that they're already on. Why did I get a noise for that? No, it's Rhodes. It's fucking Rhodes. Okay. Well. I'm so screwed. If they take it, I uh, die. This sucks. No, no, it's okay. I can hold it first. I get it first. They won't get it. I wish these fucking volunteers would stop attacking in Greece. I know. Because they're just losing fights over and over. We, can't, we don't have the power to stop them. Maybe you should, maybe I, I might send half my divisions that are in the northwest down south because they're defending on a mountain, so they're not really doing anything. So I'm having, I got five more divisions oh. coming your way. My infantry that I've been sending over to your French border is finally arriving. Thank God. Oh, I and took, now we I have binoculars. I took the newest province. Greek invention. Oh my god, you have binoculars? Could you maybe share some of that miraculous technology with me? That'd be really appreciated. I don't know what they are. I no. I really... Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, alright. I think I started with recon, actually. It just wasn't in my divisions by default. Okay. okay. Oh, my, my room is so hot when I record because i got to close all the windows. I need to get that really silent fan. Yeah, I've got, actually, like, the, the Dyson Bladeless fans. I have one. Nice. But it's actually quite cold here now. It went from Screw you. Uh, the worst su it went from the worst summer we had in five years, uh, and then here we are a week later, and it is about negative fifteen out, or not negative fifteen, fucking positive fifteen Celsius. Yeah. <laughs> negative fifteen, like literally. No, negative fifteen. Today. Negative is literally 15 dying. Is well, no, we've we've had winters that bad here. God damn, really. Um, yeah, Ontario's crazy in that we have a really we have about a fifty Celsius temperature range from summer to winter. Jesus, man. And this is the Greater Toronto area. This is where the vast majority of Canadians live. This is where almost what twelve million Canadians live of a thirty-six million population country. God damn. Yeah, we have an overpopulation issue here. It does sound like it. Well, it's because, like, uh, you know, whenever you hear Canada and you're like, oh, if I'm going to move to Canada, what's the only city name I know? Toronto. I guess I'll <laughs> live around there. I mean, that's true. That's the only one I know as that's well. So who knows anything in, in, in anywhere like that? Wait, why did I, why did I just lose? <gasps> you mother. You piece of shit. You mother piece of shit. Oh, my God. I am so fucking screwed. Why? Hang on, I got I gotta force recruit these soldiers. Hang on. Oh my god. Yeah. I've got a I've got about five divisions that are just about to finish. I uh I they've they've naval invaded Izmir. I just lost a bunch of factories. Oh, oh my god, that's so fucking terrible. It's okay. I think I can I think I'm pushing. I, I get it. They, for some reason they went straight back to the island. I just had to recruit a new general <laughs> because I my only general ran out. Uh, but my, my, my main general does have Mountaineer and Hillfighter, and he's skill 5, about to hit 6. He's actually quite a good general. Are they naval invading me right now? Are you serious? Are you fucking kidding me? This is insane. They've been naval invading me in Greece just non-stop for so long now. 
I've forgotten what it's like to be alive. Okay, this is fine. Everything is fine. I am just maddeningly force recruiting divisions just so that I have boots on the ground. Oh, there man. There are so many soldiers. This is not cool, yo. You've got some real pain in the ass things to take care of here. Yeah. I'm sending my division south to try and, like, help out the southern border. Australia controls this area. Dude, France has actually invaded you, by the way. Uh, oh, shit, where? Uh, that southern tip. They've taken one of the provinces. Oh, shit, I see it. Yeah, I'm sending yeah. a division to attack I got a fight going. Oh, I'm winning that fight. No issue. Oh, shit. Yes. I'm getting real concerned about the West. I'm about to... I'm about to push them off. Hang on. This is amazing. Hey, Italy, you want to just peace out of this war? I'm sure you've yeah, got bigger things to do. you just piss off, please? Hey, Italy, you did war with France forever ago. You want to actually, like, you know, declare war on France? I'd like the distraction. Oh, my God. That'd be so helpful, wouldn't it? Yeah. Okay, I'm actually, I'm actually pushing back against France right now. This is actually surprisingly helpful. Literally no one is in the Axis. The Axis is the smallest fascist faction in the world. Okay, the AI is just freaking terrible. Thank God. I'm so happy the AI is so bad. Like, just... Japan still hasn't chosen between Axis leanings and found our faction. <laughs> Proud of you. Oh, you're gonna get a big cut off there, aren't you? Yeah, uh, oh, no, it's only three or four, but uh, okay, now I have France. I may have just dealt with France. Their organization's really awful right now. It's so bad. What's wrong with their organization? I, I don't no know. Idea. You want me to use any of my troops to attack that big lump of dudes you cut off? Uh, no, 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 yeah, I'm, like, I'm waiting for their supply to run out. Oh, shit, they pushed us back, you pieces of garbage. Oh, Hungary is sending another one volunteer. Thanks, Hungary. Well, that would be nice. Could you maybe help me out? Okay, yeah, France Naval is... invasion noise. Uh, oh, my God, there are 12 and There are 12 I Anzacs. I think they're going for roads again. There are 12 Anzac troops. Are you serious? Uh, keep an eye on Rhodes. I think they're naval invading it again. Are you serious? I, can't... I I heard the noise, and it's bringing me to the area around Rhodes. Oh, I can't deal with so many invasions. Stop it. Okay, the French naval invasion's been warded off. Nice. Like, the, the one in Greece. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool, cool. Okay, we're just gonna- I'm, I'm letting these guys in the center get starved out so I can encircle them. Oh my god, I think I'm actually gonna take care of the Greek-Italian invaders. Nice. I'm going after the port, I'm winning the fight. Oh, let me- let me And jump, let me I jump. have them encircled, and, uh, they have a penalty for my air support, my shitty, shitty air support. I'm sending troops to help as well. Yeah, keep- keep okay, the- good. Keep the ones in the south locked down, yeah, yeah. Keep- make- make sure you keep cycling and deciding who's attacking them so that they, someone's always attacking them. Also, remember, uh, okay, because got they got it. a port, it's, if they get atta if they- they run out, they have to go back home. If they, yeah. If they lose organization, they have to fly home. Fly away! Okay, this is fine. Everything is fine. There is no need to panic. Okay, so that now because they're out of supply, I'm just going to attack the crap out of them. I'm trying to keep an eye on the naval invasion areas for you. Thanks, bud. They still haven't even tried to attack in the north. I've got France and Syria. They made a bunch of really stupid mistakes and they pulled troops back, so I'm just wrecking their face. Good. Nice. Ooh, look, 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 look southeast, look southeast, look southeast. The very bit, the very little tip of Syria, the eastern Ooh. tip of Syria, yeah? There's a, there's a little yeah. province that has three divisions. I just pull back my troops because I was going to win the battle. I pull them back so that the battle isn't won, so that I, when I encircle them, they'll get defeated. Nice. Yeah, and they get That's them. a good idea. And they die completely. Motherfucker, where do you think you're going? There, I'm moving some troops in on that, those uh, encircled cut-off nice, people nice. just to help yes, finish please. them off faster. Get the hell uh, by the way, all of my troops that are being recorded, uh, recruited right now are going to the front line with you and, and France. 
Nice. Wait, how are they? Can you recruit in my provinces? No, but like that's where I have them set to auto. Oh yeah, 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 cool, cool, cool. I've got all my infantry to defend these islands because if you look to the west, you'll see all the Australia and British peoples just standing there. Yeah, they are really, really they're, trying to break through. They are pissed. Oh, oh, dude, dude, we took the port. You got that encirclement. No, dude, look, look at Greece. You took the port. Oh shit! I didn't think I'd take it that fast. Nice. No, no, don't, don't attack them. Don't attack them. Pull oh, back okay. and wait about two weeks and let the supply run out, and then we'll kill them easily. All right. The volunteers are the ones attacking now. Hang on. Uh, you know, France is, France yeah, just reinvaded. Are. I'm gonna take out twenty nine Italian divisions That's amazing. when I attack that. That's fucking awesome. How many divisions does Italy have between forty six and a hundred? That's substantial. That's that's, that's pretty awesome. The least they're losing by that graph is a quarter of their army. Looks like uh, you just kicked some ass. Yeah. Yeah. I've beaten France as well. I've been circ I've been circled. I've killed about nine divisions. Funny to think that uh, in a weird way Germany is fighting Italy right now because of their volunteers. Their volunteers yeah. are putting in work. Those tanks are good. It's it's just the one tank, but it's, it's so helpful. Yeah. Nice. Okay, I'm also about to take six uh, French divisions in Aleppo. Oh my god. Nice. And I'm going to push south into Egypt and take Egypt. And I'll just start taking Africa. We are Africa. really pushing back. This shit was looking bad last episode. Yeah, but I, I, it's because the AI just cannot handle um, encirclements. They just don't understand what to do. So this has just manipulated mm -hmm. the crap out of them. Another Hungarian division. Uh, volunteer just arrived. I'm sure he'll go fight some dumb fight he doesn't need to. I'm sure he'll probably run immediately to the already cut off and doomed Italians. Yep. Instead of, you know, I don't know, running over to help you on the west side of Turkey. That is a crazy idea. I can't believe Italy has not even attempted to attack me on our border in Yugoslavia. Why haven't they even tried? Because it's mountain. I bet... It's, if no they point. really threw their weight into it, I don't think they would. They don't have enough tanks. The troops. They don't have enough tanks. The mountain bonus is so huge. Uh, they just waste. I mean, look at their casualties. They've lost 161,000 people, man. They're, they're... They do have a huge advantage in numbers up there. I wonder if they could win just in like a really long fight. I don't know. I think you could just keep bringing reinforcements into the mix. Oh, France is naval <laughs> fading there again. Oh, thank God I managed to deal with France. We've got loads and loads of infantry divisions being recruited very slowly. Because there are 35 British and French divisions on my islands to the west of Turkey. So I have to, like, keep at least four divisions just standing there waiting. The two German divisions are really doing work, though. I wonder how worth it it is to... Um to even bother taking those islands back right now, because I get the feeling they're just going to naval invade them over and over. Yeah. I don't think there's any point, unless you keep a troop there. I guess, yeah, you yeah. keep a troop there. Yeah. Just one soldier. you enough. know what? Yeah, one's if you, enough. If you keep one keep one soldier on all those things, yeah, and that's a 75. lot less than what we're having... That's a lot less soldiers than we're having to put there to keep them from, yeah. you know, land it's invading It's a 75% the percent malice to attack. Like that, so... I'm building four wow. more factories, so... We have really turned around the French front. I know, right? Look at this shit. This they, is they... awesome! I'm proud of us. We're doing way better than I expected. <laughs> well, of course we were going to win. Get some faith, well, MDB. I, I don't know. At the beginning of this session, shit was looking bad. Nah, man. You just got to believe. Is it worth taking uh, Cyprus? Cyprus? Uh, I, you know, I'd have to do a naval invasion. This seems too tedious. It seems like a lot of work for not much gain. Are you attacking them now, by the way? Are they out of supply yet? They're, uh, they're not, they're they not... Oh, they just ran out. Okay, moving in. And moving in. Oh, they are being slaughtered. Oh right my now. god, look, you can literally watch the division numbers go down as they get defeated, because they Is just that die. not the most satisfying thing oh, in the world? Oh, get screwed. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look at Italy's uh, infantry. 51 to 89. I'm going to look at it again when it's done. That is Their so casualties have skyrocketed this episode. Holy it's crap. Really, it's, almost, it's more than doubled this episode, their casualty count. 
I am massively pushing into a uh, thingy. Jesus. Oh, man. Oh, you just took, uh, you took French City there. I'm taking oh. so much. I mean, we call it French. <laughs> it's Syrian. Yeah. There, there's nothing they can do. For some reason, they, they pulled half of the troops back. I don't know why, but they just did. You know, if we keep this march going until we hit the UK and just keep on moving through, we can take Jerusalem. Get rid oh, of their port. Dude, dude, we can exactly control that whole canal. Dude, that's exactly what I'm doing. I'm, I'm going for the sewers, man. I want to see what happens. There's like no factories here, but it's worth a try. There's some, in, there's, yeah. some, there's a little bit in Egypt. There's about six or seven really good factories oh, in Egypt. Italy lost their fight. Oh my god. That fight in just that little corner of Greece raised their casualty count by almost 200,000. Are you serious? What? We took out a, we took out almost what? a third of their army. Oh my god, we've killed hundreds of thousands of people. I feel not even the slightest. What did we lose in that fight? Like 2,000? I don't even feel a little bit sad. That has to be the most brutal conquest. Like, we took out like 200,000 people in that one fight and lost about 2,000, 3,000 each. Oh my god, no, 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 I'm gonna lose a port. Not like these. All right, I, my troops are all spreading out, moving to other zones. I am a little worried that France is gonna- Oh god, of course they're doing it! France is naval invading that same goddamn spot again. <laughs> Just make sure they don't get a port and it's fine. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're trying to get a port, I think. Oh, oh yeah. Athens? Get the shit out of here, France. Leave my land. This is mine. God, the sheer number of divisions that are attacking me is just uncomfortable. But it's okay. Oh god, they took Athens. Yeah, yeah, I've got troops moving no, in. No, I got I got six right there. I'm stopping them. I think Good. we I think you need to keep a few divisions in the south of Greece just to And I think maybe we should start yeah, we should start putting I'm some stuff. That. We should start putting some stuff in that area so we can actually try and beat them. Like try and get through that bottleneck. Yeah. Like why not, right? Alright, let's do it. I just um tell some of my troops that used to be in the south of Greece to go up there. And I also have, uh, you know, I don't need seven divisions for that. Let's lower that to five divisions to just defend lower Greece, where I keep getting naval uh, wh invasions. Why do I keep getting the naval invasion sound? I don't know. It's going crazy on my end. Oh, Anzacs are fucking attacking me as well. This is crazy. The AI is actually doing naval invasions. I've never seen this before. What is this sorcery? I know. Everything's fine. Oh my god, they actually took a province. They took a Dana. Get the fuck out of here. Wow, they are hitting the seas hard around Athens. I know. There's so much naval. Oh, no, shit. We let them get too, in, too close. We, you need to bring some troops to Athens. This is why they can never get a port. Yep. It's okay, because they're, they're in circle, because there's only one way to attack it. They, they, they're suffering encirclement penalty. Yeah, yeah. I've got five troops moving in. Shit, man. If they manage to get a foothold there, we're done. Yeah, and I just I just hired another general to take care oh, of that. Oh fuck! Are you serious right now? Get the. I do have air superiority on Athens, actually. Weirdly enough. Oh shit! Australians are attacking what? us. Oh shit! Yeah, yeah. It's alright. I stopped them from getting a port, so they should be able. They shouldn't be able to do much here. God fucking damn! Please go away. Why do you think this is appropriate? Nobody wants your kind here. Hey, Iraq, you want to send us volunteers? I don't know why you would, but, like, do you want it? It'd be really cool of you. Oh, man. Wow. Wow! Is that Canada, too? Yeah, Canada and uh, Australia putting in some work. Okay, I should be able to stop these Australians now. These damned Australians. These filthy Australians. Um, so the number of divisions... So because they've taken Athens, and they are, like, proper screwing you. Yeah, we I know. My troops are almost them. there. We should not My have let them take that My troops just arrived. Over. 
Dude. Yeah? Dude. Yeah? We can take that bottleneck. I can? Yeah. Whoa, shit, there's like nothing there! Leave the mountain province alone, take the one to the south. Go, go, go. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Do it. Oh my god, let's go. Alright, I'm ready. <sighs> oh, they're losing. They they're are losing. losing this fight. They're gonna lose Italy. They didn't see that shit coming. Get the fuck- Oh, look, and they're just immediately moving troops to the north. But if we can take this, and take Venice or something, we could grab the river, and we gain- You, you gain yeah. like 12 factories. That's gonna be awesome. Okay, I'm fine with regards to Syria and all this crap. Ooh, the Munich Agreement. Oh, so they demanded to Denton land. Well, we expected that as well. Unfortunately. <sighs> this is fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Everything's okay. Yes, there is a I'm very- I'm concerned about how they took a bunch of little provinces in different spots. Okay. Oh my god, um, I'm so low on infantry on. equipment. It's just, it's just the deficit is going to last for three days. 39 days. I don't think that's true. I think you're lying to me. I have 5.6 thousand deficit. Jesus. Maybe maybe you could send me some lead leaves, man. I'm low. I'm low. Um, I'm in the I'm I'm losing it per turn, but I do still have a five and a half thousand. Ah, uh, nah, keep it, keep it. All right, if you're sure. Well, I could take a thousand. Uh, hold on, let me. Uh, can I just? Do I need to do send land lease, or can I just dump a bunch off onto you all? You just once? go uh, send land lease, and you can click just do one delivery, and then you can set how many you want. Okay. Live. Uh, number monthly once units a thousand. There we go. Thanks, man. Oh. There is your supply drop. That'll help me somewhat. Thank you. Okay, I just realized I have the recruitment on high priority. That's not good. Oh shit! Yes. Why did the fight in the in the northwest stop? I just got tanks. What happened? Oh. Nice. Unfortunately, of course, there are three tanks and three infantry divisions that need to be changed, but I'm still. getting really worried about Athens, by the way. Oh my god, that's not good. Yeah. There's some volunteers standing there from... That's not Spanish flag, because... Yes, National of Spain. I forgot they actually sent one volunteer earlier. I'm bringing many, as many as I can, man. I'm sending, I'm sending more over. Improved Artillery 2 just finished. I can switch over to better artillery. No, you bastards! They take another province. It's okay, it's fine, it's fine. Alright, I just switched to producing uh, level 2 artillery. Nice, nice. You are very much ahead of me in the artillery game. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Ah, uh, Tibet's got a really badass flag. Just take a look. Oh my god, that's awesome. Look at their leader. This dude's like, what? The Tibetan leader? Yeah. Whoa, that hat! That hat, man. That is ostentatious. Ooh, Balkan strategy. That doesn't sound good if I remember where the Balkans are. Oh, that's fine. Uh, it just means uh, that they, it just means they start to defend the area on the Balkans a bit better, but whatever, that was that was an inevitability. I really well, wish Germany if... would declare war on France. I really wish they would. If Poland is smart, they'll take the free alliances they can get in the Balkans. Yeah. Oh my god. So much death. Actually, um... Uh, Poland can also really easily get Finland to join them, too. If you play it carefully, um... Poland can actually kick the Soviet Union's ass, because they can have such a wide line for the Soviet Union to defend. Yeah, playing Poland's they really fun. Can... Yeah, Poland is awesome. Like, you can get all the way from the southern tip of Poland all the way to the northern tip of Finland to be the Soviet Union's front line in that war. I really like doing that thing where you just take Czechoslovakia really quickly to get the factories and then defend against Germany and just sit there, build loads of forts, and just let them throw themselves at you and see what happens. That sounds fun. I haven't tried that. I've tried that against the Soviet Union, it's and that's so good. I haven't tried it against just Germany. Just be Poland, invade Czechoslovakia as soon as you go fascist, and literally... As soon as you take it, have as many infantry divisions as possible in every province Germany touches. Build as many land forts as you can. 
and then just literally just stand there like come at you bro and watch their casualties mount up if they beat you they win but oh shit i just realized um they they won the northwest battle should we attack again uh yeah I, well I, I said that earlier that our fight there stopped should we attack again uh, with yeah, everything I'm up for, uh, yeah go for it Fucking i'm up it. for it I I'm, really, mov I'm like, moving in oh shit can you do one division to attack the mountain ones so they don't reinforce sure thanks I should keep them at least there for a little while. Okay, we're attacking from multiple directions, so we should be okay. Also, your general's a mountaineer, which is awesome. Yeah, um, my general's really bad as he's rank six. He is hill fighter, mountaineer, and what's the last one here? Trickster for reconnaissance. So I've actually got an okay general. It's pretty kick ass, man. Oh, and they're defending against another naval invasion. Who would have thought? Athens is terrifying me. Yeah, I, I'm sending three tank divisions to you as soon as I can get there. Their but, organization's horrible in Athens. Uh, yeah, if we could kill, hey, if if we can get a kill there, it, a lot it, of dudes, it, it wouldn't but they kill. They just they just retreat. I think they just go back. Yeah. Oh, I think it's about time I head to bed. I think. We are at war Shit. with almost the entirety of Africa. Wait, I just you, realized. Seriously? Let me take, oh well, my god. Well, look at it. It's, it's Italy, UK, That's and France terrible. are most of Africa. That's awful. Yeah, that southern front's going to go in for a while. I mean, if we want to, once we take the canal, um, we could just get a few land forts and forget about it. Yeah. Oh, man, everyone hates us. This is the worst. Huh. Okay, All this, right. this is fine. Yeah. Everything's this is, fine. This is a good stopping point. Good on stopping the next point. episode, <laughs> on the next episode, we we might make a little progress on Italy and the Northwest, but it's not looking like it because we lost up there again. Yeah. I just got two two uh, volunteers from Nationalist Spain just started coming in. Oh, goody. Let's hope I get some as well. Yeah, and uh, we'll see the conclusion to what's going on in Athens because we are slowly losing that fight, and if we full-on lose it, Shit's gonna go down. But think how many are being lost, though. There's 62. Uh, oh my god, there's so many divisions. I can't even count them. There's just a lot of divisions. Yeah. Jesus. All right. I'm concerned. Me too. I'm. I'm. I'm not. We're. Conf I'm confident. We're gonna win this. Don't worry. Don't worry. All right. All right. I was Alger Hill, and I will continue to be. This has been Hearts of Iron Four, uh, Madrid Red Collab. It's been pretty fun. I'm really enjoying Love Boat. I'm enjoying it. I love boats great. I'm literally scared, but I'm enjoying it. Holy shit. Okay. Bye-bye.